What's up, GI Dojo fans? Uh, lately, I've been picking up some of the, the Marvel uh, Hasbro Titan Hero series figures, and uh, I just picked up this 14-inch Sentinel. Uh, so we're going to take a look at that. I'm just going to film the box here for a second, and then we'll open them up. The Titan Heroes figures are typically 12-inch, uh, but this guy's 14-inch. He's meant to tower over the 12-inch figures a little bit. Um, also, they have a, a series of four inch figures for this X-Men 97 uh, revival season that they're going to release on Disney plus. And so this Sentinel works either way. You can have him kind of fight head to head with the, uh, the 12 inch Titan heroes or the four inch X-Men 97 figures. So it'll be kind of in scale. So let's go ahead and open up the box and uh, see what he looks like. Okay. So we got the Sentinel out of the package. I uh, got, you know, some other scales, other figures here, just to do some size comparison. Uh, so, yeah, this is, this looks a lot like the uh, Sentinels, how they were depicted in the 1992 animated series. Um, you got five points of articulation, although the uh, joints are, they are um, ball jointed. So you got, you got a little more uh, articula articulation than the, the standard, um, you know, Hasbro Titan Heroes. Uh, here is a sp armored Spider-Man Titan Hero. As you can see, he doesn't have the ball joints. He's just like a uh, shampoo bottle, some people call <laughs> call them, but uh, because of the, the ball joints uh, on the, the Sentinel, it's a little bit better articulation. Now this Sentinel, the reason it's 14 inches, uh, they, they kind of lumped it into the Titan Heroes line, but in reality, it's supposed to... Uh, you know, it's supposed to tower over four inch figures. Like here's a Destro reaction figure because um, for the X-Men 97, um, you know, series that's coming out, it's like a revival season that continues the original X-Men animated series. It's gonna be on Disney Plus. Um, th they made a line of uh, four inch scale um, X-Men that would, you know, I haven't purchased those yet. I, I don't know if I will, but, um, you know, if you place them next to this guy, he towers over them like like they do in the animated series. Uh, also, I uh, brought over a uh, Spin Master, uh, the Flash, Michael Keaton, Batman, and uh, you know it's it, they're they're the same price point as the Titan Heroes, like this guy, also twelve inch, but the Spin Master puts um, you know ball joints at the uh, at the shoulders, at the elbow, swivel at the wrist. Um, you know, they, they have like way better, uh, you know, they have a 90 degree bend at the knees, way better articulation. I wish that Hasbro would, uh, step up their game and add a couple more points of articulation to the Titan heroes, uh, because it's not a question of money. I mean, Spin Master, a smaller company can sell these for $9.99 with all the extra added articulation. Hasbro, it's a way bigger company. Uh, they can afford to do it and, you know, still still make money. So, um, yeah, this has been the, uh, X-Men 97 Sentinel from the Titan hero series. He's 14 inches and, uh, that's how he scales with, with other action figures. Have a good one guys.